Fulham under-21s were looking for back-to-back -back league wins on Friday when they travelled across London to face Arsenal. After a competitive start, George Wickens did well to keep out a Mario Cosia-Dubri, who found himself charging towards goal. Our lads thought they should have been awarded a penalty just before the half-hour mark, when George Ocas was tugged back just as he was running towards goal. It was only given as a free kick, and Dibli Diaz's attempt was well hit, but straight at the goalkeeper. We almost capitalised on another error soon after. Following some neat passing, the ball fell to Luke Harris, but he was quickly closed down. Our pressing was working a treat and led to yet another huge opportunity. Ollie Sanderson squared the ball to Callum McFarlane, but his strike was heroically cleared off the line. Steve Wigley's side continued to pile on the pressure in North London. Ocas watched as his decent low strike was just wide of the far post. Eventually the deadlock was broken and it was a real gift. The ball was played out straight to Harris, who steadied himself before firing us ahead. Wickens was kept fairly quiet overall, but made his second brilliant save of the game to deny James Sweet from a tight angle. The game took a huge turn with just over five minutes remaining. With Wickens limping off with an injury and all of our substitute windows having been used, centre-back Charlie Robinson saw himself donning the gloves and blue jersey for the remainder of the game. Our defence did excellently to protect him, but it was to be last-minute heartbreak. Sweet's powerful header had too much on it for Robinson and the game finished one apiece. A good point on the road regardless for under-21s, who now prepare for a semi-final against Brentford on Thursday.